Now, the festive season is in full swing and Golden Cloud and Beacon, they are on the search for South Africa's best bakers. Now, five lucky viewers stand a chance to get paired with a professional chef and compete live in Expresso's kitchen for the grand prize valued at 50,000 Rand. Now, online, we have Alison Maget who entered with a decadent chocolate jelly tots cake. Alison, good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Leanne. Oh, well, listen, we are so inspired by what you created. But tell us, what was the inspiration behind you entering this competition? Leanne, I've always wanted to enter. I've tried many, many times, and yeah, it happened this year. It's always been my, my thing to do this. I love baking, I love my kitchen, and I'm always taking a chance on, on, on a recipe, and oh. I had to enter. Amazing, amazing. Well, listen, we are very happy to announce that you have been selected by our viewers as our third Festive Baker Search finalist. Congratulations. Oh, awesome. Oh, how does it feel to be selected and to know that you're going to be in that finale? You don't want to know. It's a dream come true. I am so overwhelmed. Oh, well, listen, congratulations and get all the I creative have juices. Running. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> well, listen, we're going to be holding thumbs for you. Congratulations on making it into the finals. And we can't wait to see you here on our Feel Good Breakfast show to see you baking. Thank you, Leanne. And thank you to the peeps that sign And thank you to everyone that voted for me as well. Oh, you are most welcome. Well, there you have it. We have our third finalist, even though she kept calling me Leanne. That's okay. I'll take it. I'm flattered. But Jenny Morris, you're in the kitchen right now as we're about to have some fun creating a Christmas festive board. Basically, oh my goodness, this, this board. is perfect for entertaining <laughs> because it's going to have a little bit of everything on it. Well, we'll start off with some sugar and some butter mm -hmm. because these are going to be the best chocolate chip cookies you've ever had and we're using golden cloud we're using golden cloud you're adding tons of sugar oh, we are yes. making some sugar in fact we are not just making sugar we're making chocolate chip cookies but how was that game you just played earlier you know that teeth was... sensitivity uh, listen i want to tell you lisa thank goodness there is a remedy for heat sensitivity but that with that tongue twister got me huh? with the last one no, the middle one. The middle one. The okay. pumpkin one. The pumpkin one. Okay, okay. That's always a tough one. So while you're busy making our yes. batter and our cookie dough, yes. I'm going to start off with our chocolate bark. And this is where we're going to have Beautiful. a lot of fun. So we've melted some of our beacon heavenly flavors. I've got some ivory. I've got some milk chocolate. And we're just going to mix them all together. In fact, maybe I should... Just use a spoon to do this. You know, what I love about this is that all of these beautiful chocolate slabs, it's just a matter of go snip, 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 thank you, Beacon. And you're going to pop them out onto um, the tray. Yes, so it's okay it if I get the ever. chocolate into here because we're going to yes, swirl it all together. Yes, you want to swirl together. it anywhere, yeah. And this is quite cool to get the kids involved. I saw this on uh, online where they did the swirl with different colored chocolates yes. and then just adding pretzels and all kinds of Delicious. fun treats. And we've got here even some of our beacon treats, our licorice all sorts. Wow. <gasps> These are my favorite. Oh, yes. The wine gum. The wine gums. But let me tell you something. You have to put a mask on the kids, huh? To get them to be as creative as possible no, or to just hide get the, it out of sight? keep their sight. mouths empty <laughs> with all those beautiful beacon sweeties. Okay, so what I've got here is um, I've got my eggs, I've got uh, my two sugars, I've got some baking powder, I've got my golden cloud, um, the butter. It's all coming together nicely to make this dough. And then what I've got here is the best ever amount of chocolate to make these gorgeous chocolate chip cookies. I've made some there already, actually, Zoe. Oh, Look at you. Fantastic. I'm just trying yes. to get the chocolate to spread all over without falling on the floor. And you did say you're using our golden cloud cake flour. Yeah. Now, our golden cloud cake flour, it is a baker's all-rounder, known for delivering the softest bakes, as well as to help those Christmas cakes come perfectly this festive season. And then we are using our beacon chocolates. We are using our beacon sweets and just all of the goodness that beacon has to offer and because it's been around and loved by South Africans since 1938, it's also available in a decadent dessert range, including the Malfa pudding, the chocolate mm. brownie, as well as the peppermint tart, which I have here in front of me. And we're going to add this all to our board. So I'm going to, I've got our chocolate mixed up and swirled. I'm going to add some of our jelly tots. Oh, beautiful, darling. And I've got my gorgeous... Um, cookie dough here and you what you could do is you could use a tablespoon 
um, but I like to use an ice cream scoop and you get even sizes, because if you have a look at our chocolate chip cookies there, Look at this. Just look at all that beacon goodness in there, girl. That. Look at all that chocolate. And then, of course, you're now just going to assemble. So once your, your chocolate bark is pretty much ready, pop this into the fridge, allow it to set and cool, and then when it's done, you can cut. Or It's actually quite nice if you break it. But then you can um, just simply uh, put it onto the board. Lovely. And I love the whole rustic idea. It need, yes. mustn't be perfect. Well, the practice makes perfect. Give me one of those packets and let me open them for Which you. Which one would you like? Oh, give me my favourite. Your favourite. There you go. Thank you, we, I'll open up our heavenly peppermint tart. Oh, divine. And then, you know, Jenny, you can't put cookie dough in front of me and not allow me to taste the batter. I know. You and I were munching the dough earlier, weren't we? The bread dough. I'm use a little uh, a knife over here just yes. to cut myself a piece of that batter. <laughs> oh, that's my favourite colour. The yellow one. Yes. Oh, I'm going to grab it's into this. It's my favourite, favourite. Should we put some uh, mm. of these? There's just so much going. Some more jelly sauce. These are chocolates. Add them. I do approve of the cookie dough. Ah. I love the, the, the creaminess that's coming through, but also the chocolate chips. Oh, yes, absolutely. Mm. Perfect. Oh. Look at these. This I've never had these before. Look. The chocolate coated jelly tots. Never. And you can just really make this whole board. The bigger the board, the more accessories and treats you can add. Oh, we can have lots of fun with this. Oh, Jordan, we can indeed. <laughs> I, I think I should wear a mask. It's <laughs> okay, this mask. it's okay. <gasps> Look at these. Well, Jenny, I'm going to leave this up to you. Okay, darling. Because I think there are quite a few people that still want to know how they can enter and be part of the baking, baker search, the Golden Cloud baker search that we've got on your Feel Good Breakfast show. Now, if you would love to be one of the five finalists competing on Expresso for the grand prize of 50,000 Rand in cash, the winning contestant and chef duo will be crowned live here on Espresso. Now to enter, it's really easy. Bake with Golden Cloud and Beacon, snap a picture, and share your bake using hashtag Golden Baker Search 2022 on social media, and tell us why you should be a finalist. You can also WhatsApp your entry to 078 102 there are T's and C's that can be found on our website, and that's available at expressoshow.com. Jenny, are you Yum. ready? Yum. I'm so ready. Let's put some of these beautiful Let's marshmallows. Let's put it all on. I, I it love these um, as well. They're nice for baking. You can pack some out, and I'm going to show you a little trick. Okay. You pack them out. Finish off the plate. Yes. These are my favorite, the licorice Oh, sorts. gosh, me too. The black and ones the more with the coconut, pills. the better. I'm going to save this one for later. Okay. You oh, you're cutting it smaller? That. No, no, Actually, no, you're going to do that. I'm going to make a flour to go onto our cookies. Okay. Let's just... Okay, well, listen, if this. you want to get your hands on this recipe for the cookie dough that we've made, as well as perhaps the inspiration to create your own Christmas board, it is available on our website, expressoshow.com. And while Jenny Morris is also showing us how to make a little yeah, flour. Just a little flour. Out of marshmallows. Yeah, a little marshmallow blomaki. With a little jelly tot chocolate cup. Yeah. Oh, amazing. Jenny, always great to have you in the kitchen. It's always lovely to be in the kitchen, oh. especially with you, Miss. Get creative and good luck with entering.